Hi friends and welcome to Crumbs from Jarad. What is your special calling? The time came for Elizabeth to be delivered and she gave birth to a son and her neighbors rejoiced with her and on the eighth day they came to circumcise the child and they would have named him Zechariah after his father. But his mother said, Not so, he shall be called John. And immediately his mouth was opened and he spoke, blessing God. And all said, What then will this child be? For the hand of the Lord is with him. The birth of a child always is a time for rejoicing. But in the case of this child, there was more rejoicing because first of all the parents were childless. And now in their old age, they had a child. And secondly, in those days, the birth of a son added more joy. Now the time came for the child to be named. For a boy, on the eighth day, the boy was named, the child was named. For a girl within the first 30 days. And how did they choose the name? The name was given the father's name or the grandfather's name or one of their relatives' names. But when they were asked, what name will you give? They said, John. Why did Elizabeth choose the name John? Because that's what she was told by God. And the name John means God is gracious. And truly God has been gracious to Elizabeth and Zechariah. But interestingly, the neighbors say, what then will this child be? Because the hand of God is upon him. The fact is, when every child is born, it should be the same. As Mother Teresa says, every child comes into the world with a message from God. And so it is when you were born. The hand of God is upon you, but more so, the heart of God was upon you. You have come with a message from God. And therefore, we are called to live out that message. But you will say, how do I know what is my calling? Take a look at your talents. But more importantly, listen to your heart. Deep within your heart, there's something you know that you're meant to be, something you know that you're meant to do. Carry on and do it. That is what God wants of you. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Have a wonderful day with Jesus.